From planes to cars, electric and autonomous cars are expected to shape the auto industry's future. And there's one company that wants to be at the center of it all. Phil LeBeau reports from Glendale, Wisconsin. While the growth in electric vehicles and lithium ion batteries is receiving plenty of attention from investors, the folks here at Johnson Controls just outside Milwaukee believe the traditional lead acid battery still has plenty of growth. In fact, the company is doubling its capacity of its next generation start stop batteries here in the United States. These batteries, which turn off when a car is idling, are 5% more efficient than traditional batteries and part of JCI's push to improve the overall performance of vehicles with smart diagnostics. Right now, about 10% of the vehicles sold in the U.S. have start-stop batteries, but the CEO believes that demand will increase in the coming years as the auto industry focuses on fuel efficiency and greater performance. Trying to find a car in Europe that's not start-stop, you're not going to, and five years from now, be very difficult in the United States or China anywhere else to find a car that's not start stop. Johnson Controls recently announced plans to build a fourth battery plant in China, the world's largest auto market. All of this as it spins off its slower growing automotive interiors and seat divisions to Tyco. While shares of JCI have moved higher in recent weeks, this stock, like so many other automotive supplier stocks, has largely been ignored by investors over the last couple of years mainly because they're skeptical it will generate significant returns in the years to come. Phil LeBeau, Nightly Business Report, Glendale, Wisconsin.